Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Dave Anderson, Helicool's Helipad. Today we're going to be making some stencils for the LMTV and just kind of show you what kind of things that I have come up with to kind of help you get the all the stencils back in the right order and everything correct. If you're trying to keep your LMTV with all the correct stencils, uh, you'll need to have a Cricut machine and be able to uh, use it properly and cut out all these stencils and that's if you want to maintain the stencils as the manufacturer gave it to the military which is what I wanted to do because I need to keep my LNTV um, a little bit more stock uh, so it, or original let's say. The first thing that I did is I took photographs of the stencils that I'd have a reference later. Here's a no step on the front bumper as well as another tie down toolkit, gas tank, stakes, poles, panel stowage, where the ladder goes on the back, another tie down, lift point, transmission oil stick, engine oil, transmission oil, coolant, windshield washer fluid, and of course the star. As you could tell by the condition of the paint, it definitely needed to be repainted completely. A lot of rust was on it, um, and it, the, the paint was just in terrible condition, including the stencil paint. So that was one of the first orders of business uh, when I first bought the LMTV, was to make sure that it was a fresh coat of paint and new stencils were replaced. And then what I did is I came back and measured um, how big these letters should be and then uh, use the Cricut to cut them out and basically all this is is uh, very it's just uh, like cardstock paper it's not very thick you don't want it to be uh, um, super thick although it can be a little bit more the Cricut can handle it pretty well but um, so this is how I, I took care of all of the um, uh, stencils because I need to get mine well <laughs> because it goes to the gospel mission I did remove the star that's in um, front and back and replaced it with a cross instead because uh, the, the uh, truck is I do it for the gospel mission and um, and we basically put it in parades to increase the awareness of the mission and occasionally we uh, pick up large uh, food donations when people do food drives and we use a truck in other certain kind of ways but that's basically why we have a LMTV and if you in case you're ever wondering been working on a few things with the Cricut and uh, made a YouTube several YouTube stickers actually 
Um, this goes in combination. Um, this is really cool what I made here. This is I turned the Joe Cool into a Heli Cool <laughs> with Snoopy. This is a two color, uh, black and white. And I uh, did a couple of uh, Marvin the Martian because I really like Marvin the Martian. Um, some more YouTube stuff. Anyway, having a lot of fun with that. I, I really enjoy that. The Cricut really is a pretty wonderful tool. The only thing that I don't like about it is that you pretty much have to go online and do everything online, upload things to them. Uh, but the, the stuff that you get back is actually pretty good. Um, and there's plenty of YouTube videos on how to use it. So I wasn't going to go into uh, how to use it again, just because there's so much stuff out there. Um, it's uh, pretty user friendly and it does a wonderful job. I'm pretty happy with it and if I was to rate it I would definitely give it at least four to maybe four and a half stars out of five. I don't think that there's anything else out on the market that I have seen in its price range that could touch it. So Cricut pretty much has this uh, market fairly well cornered up and uh, uh, I just wish that there was something that, that uh, you could do so that I could do stuff on my own instead of not online. That would be the trick, wouldn't it? Hey, if you really need to know where to place the stencils and to get those painted back on, uh, just in case yours was painted or they're faded and you want to bring it back to a more of original equipment look, uh, just put a comment in the uh, down below in the video and uh, I'll make sure to get back to you. Hey, it's been a pleasure. I'm Dave Anderson. This is Helly Cool Sellypad. Until next time, be safe and God bless. Thank you.